DAP veteran Lim Kit Siang has questioned the justification over appointments of special advisors by Prime Minister Ismail Sabri Yaakob when there are already ministers for the portfolios. This came after Minister in the Prime Minister's Department, Abdul Latif Ahmad, told Parliament yesterday that the Prime Minister's third advisor, who will advise him on matters related to health, is still in the process of being appointed. With this, Kit Siang questioned if the appointment was a reflection of Ismail Sabri's lack of confidence in the ministers concerned. He asked if the country is suffering from an attack of advisor mania and wondered if Ismail Sabri will eventually have 31 special advisors shadowing the ministers in the cabinet. In a written parliamentary reply dated the 1st of December, Abdul Latif had explained that the advisors who are appointed are those who have network, experience and expertise in the matters related to the scope of their duties, which can benefit the country's developmental efforts in line with the Keluarga Malaysia concept. He said this in reply to a question from Pejuang Skubang Pasu MP Amaruddin Hamza, who had asked how many special advisors the Prime Minister has and their financial implications on the government. Previously, in early November, Abdul Latif said Ismail Sabri had three special advisors who advise him on health, religion, as well as law and human rights. Abdul Latif also said that at the time, each special advisor's office cost 50,000 ringgit, including their staff.